Hi, I'm Martin Blazer, and I'm the author of Missing Microbes. In my book, I discuss how when women are pregnant, as they're moving toward the end of their pregnancy, their microbes are changing. The microbes in their birth canal are changing. The microbes in their intestinal tract are changing. And we know that some of those changes are, are, are very good for the baby, to give the baby the right organisms to start off life. So when the baby is just about ready to be born, they're, they're in the womb, which is sterile. And then they begin their first exposure to life by passage through the birth canal. And as they're passing, passing through the birth canal, they're picking up bacteria. They're covered with the bacteria from their mother. They swallow the bacteria. And this is how mammals have been doing it for more than 100 million years, whether they're uh, elephants or mice or dolphins or humans. Now, some things have changed in recent years. For example, uh, lots of women are getting antibiotics while they're pregnant. We currently estimate more than half of the pregnant women in the United States are getting antibiotics. And some of them are getting antibiotics right at the moment of delivery. And there are some very good reasons for this, but no one has taken into account the idea that the antibiotics have some cost, some biological cost. And in, in my book, I discuss the costs and the benefits of uh, early, early antibiotics. And one of the possible factors is that the antibiotics are causing some kinds of extinctions, that some organisms aren't being passed from mother to child as they have been since time immemorial. We know that the whole process of giving birth and breastfeeding is highly choreographed so that the bacteria that the babies pick up when they're passing through the birth canal, they're now inoculating to their mother's breast. And when the mother is nursing them, they're getting the bacteria and the breast milk together. And the breast milk has special compounds that feed those bacteria. So it's not accidental at all, but in fact designed by nature to, to optimize the health uh, of the baby. And the antibiotics are changing this. We're changing to this by using a lot of formula. And of course, there's also the issue of cesarean section, which is an important operation, but the use of cesarean sections has just grown remarkably. We think that the, the basic rate should be somewhere around 5%. And 20 years ago, it was one woman, one woman out of five in the U.S. who was giving birth by uh, giving birth by cesarean section. Now it's one woman in three. And in some countries, it's one woman in two. And I think, and in the book, I discuss that nobody's really taking into account what the potential biological cost of this is. And that, that's a factor that I think is playing a role in our changing microbiome.